Guess nobody's home. Most guys bring home a 45 or an M1. This is pretty extreme. Quite a flock you got here, kid. A strange obsession. The river tunnels. This guy's a tunnel rat. I know every one of them. Oh my god, Ira. You poor backwards son of a bitch. Peterson, I'm going to need some help. I've got Monroe, Fontaine, and all the others. It's all tied up nicely. It goes all the way to the top. Meet me at the LA River Tunnel entrance just north of the First Street Bridge in half an hour. Don't ask questions. Just be there. This is DA's investigator Jack Kelso. I have an urgent radio message for Detective Cole Phelps. KGPL. 11K, see the man. A 207 just occurred on the spillway north of the First Street Bridge. DA's investigator Jack Kelso reports a kidnapping suspect outstanding in the LA River tunnel system with a hostage. 11K, here's the that. three. The hell is Jack playing at? Like a suicide note. Half the LAPD will be down there hunting for him. We need to get there first. All units on all frequencies stand by. Car 86 Adam is in pursuit of suspect vehicle heading southwest on Sunset Boulevard. Suspect vehicle belonging to Jack Kelso, described as a Navy Chevrolet fleet line. License number 4, William 0286. 
car. 86 Adam is in pursuit. I picked up his car. I'll need help to make it to the river. That's Kelso's car. All units, Chief Laurel reports that the suspect is armed and extremely dangerous. Repeat, extremely dangerous. Suspect vehicle to be disabled immediately. If necessary, use of deadly force is authorized. Uh, I'll the suspect vehicle headed west on 5th Street. Repeat, the Chevy Fleet Line Navy Blue, westbound on 5th Street. Jesus Christ, how many cops do these guys own? All units, all units, we have a new suspect vehicle. It is shop number 13516. Repeating, shop 13516 is a second suspect vehicle. Described as a green Hudson Commodore. License 3, Sam, 0102. Reported to be aiding suspect Jack Kelso. Use caution to continue pursuit. All units, stand by for further. All units, suspect vehicle sign is heading northeast toward 3rd Street on the embankment between 3rd and 4th. All units, suspect vehicle is now northbound on Los Angeles, passing 2nd Street. Car 66 Adam, 77 Adam, go to 1st and Alameda. Car 19 William, go to 1st and Vignes. Repeat 1st and Vignes. Units to handle, identify code 3. All units, further to the 2nd suspect vehicle, shop 1. Five one six. Chief Moral has authorized the use of deadly force. Repeat, use of deadly force is authorized in disabling both suspect vehicles. Who's this guy? Peterson, assistant DA. What's he doing? He's here, here to cover our backs. I'm going in there, Jack. No one's trying to stop you. I found this at the ranch house. He's marked his routes. I'll go in here. Cole, you take the next entrance. Biggs, I need you to take the car and cover this spot here. I think that's his fail-safe exit. Cole, he's one of ours. What are you talking about? Right where you are! Got it? Got it. Peterson, you want to be DA? We'll earn your salt. So, Kelso is your boy, Peterson? And working with Phelps? A handy lad, that Kelso. Yes, he is, Chief. You can't imagine what those two have uncovered. It could go all the way to the top. I hope you won't be implicated. So, you're the new broom, Peterson? Looks like it. And you think he'll make it out of there alive? I think you might. He's a difficult boy to get rid of. All right, Peterson. I'm listening. What's your offer? Throw out the gun!
the gun. That's it, out of ammo. Water's rising. You're surrounded and your buddies are dead. Water's rising.
the guns. Are you okay, Princess? I felt better. He saved me from the doctor. Hi, Tex. Do you remember me? I'm not sure that I do. Have you come here to kill her? Why would I do that, soldier? Isn't that why you're all here? I'm here to get her out. Her. But not me. You haven't come for me. No, not you. It ends here. You were with the 6th on Sugarloaf, weren't you? I was. And Naha? Yes, I was. You're Sergeant Jack Kelso, aren't you? Where's your uniform, Sarge? At home in my locker, Hogaboom! War's over, soldier! I know that, Sarge. I'm fighting a different kind of war. I fight for God now. We all fight for God, Ira. In our own ways. Not everyone knows it. Elsa! Are you all right? Get away from her! It's all right, Cole. He doesn't want to hurt her. Ira was with us on Okinawa. What? You know this guy? Don't you remember me, Lieutenant? I remember you. No. I don't. You ordered me to burn that cave, Lieutenant. That cave full of civilians. A hospital. What is he talking about? It was war. For God's sake, I can't be held responsible for everything that happened. I don't blame you, Lieutenant. You helped me to help other people. Ira lost his mind on Okinawa, Princess. Sheldon asked the doctor to help him get back. The doctor helped me to find my path. And I helped him to a better life. Elsa's going to leave now, Ira. She will be all right. You've helped her, too. Get her out of here. Vix will help. His ex is nearby. Jack, I need this guy to make the case. Hasn't this poor bastard given you enough? Get out of here now! For God's sake, Jack, what are you going to do? Don't cry, miss. Sergeant Kelso has come to help ease my way. I was proud to serve with you, Jack. Get out of here, Cole! Stop the goddamn screaming! I need to think! And how do you expect to do that, you fucking maniac? They're burned to a crisp! Finish them off. Do it humanely. We are leaving this place. You do it, Phelps. Get your own fucking hands dirty. Ah! I'm out of morphine. Ah! Ah! Put these people out of their pain. Now! That's an order! Everyone out of here now. Double time! You two get Lieutenant Phelps to an aid station. Weapon team will be blowing this place in two minutes. Everything that happened in here stays in here. Do you hear me? I don't want to ever hear another word about it. Doing him a favor, Elsa. Cole, up here! 
I'll get this great hurry, hurry. The water is rising. They're first. Hand her up. Get out of here. You're not Jack. I'm not arguing. You're wounded, Jack. Let me help. What are you waiting for? Jump, Cole. Jump for it. I... We're gathered here to honor Detective Cole Phelps. Cole Phelps was the best kind of man. Hear, hear. A war hero who led his men with true valor and through his personal bravery achieved one of his country's highest honors. A cop wrongly accused who never lost his faith in the LAPD and the system. Fine. You belittle his memory. Elsa. Get out of my way, Jack. You call yourself his friend. A detective who fought to expose the evil corruption of the murderous Dr. Fontaine and the rapacious property tycoon Leyland Monroe. Go to her. Will you, Herschel? A reformer who You're recognized friend, the need Jack. to remove the odd bad apple from a department right. made up of good men. Herschel? A man who never gave up. Yeah, Jack. Who continued to fight enemy. the good fight. I think you knew that, Jack. The fight that cost him his own life. A good husband. A good father. And may I say, a good friend. Turn to surprise as you feel the pain. 
Judge and jury, they all agree. If love's the crime, I'm doing time, and I don't look like I'll ever get free. Yeah, baby, you know I'm guilty. Baby, you know I'm guilty. While you're my Clyde, I'll be your Bonnie. Pretend I'll be good again, but while loving you's the charge, I'll never be. Cause baby, you know I'm guilty. Baby, you know I'm guilty So lock me up and throw away the key I don't need no bail If you're the jail Just give me life and grant me no reprieve Cause baby, you know This case is closed And don't suppose I'll make a plea Cause baby, you know I'm guilty Well, I need something To soothe this pain To cool the love you pump through my veins Cause I'm burning I'm burning up for you. And I need something to quench this fire before it becomes a funeral pyre. Yeah. struck the sparks you fanned the flames in me and now my heart's a blazing ruin you say that you were Torch soon when I'm burning. 
Struck the sparks, you fire the flames in me. And now my heart, a blazing ruin, you say that. How about this for a headline? Guess which former Sixth Marine hero has been promoted in the LAPD? No idea. Well, it could be anybody. You give up? Tell us or hand over the fucking paper. The Shadow Boys, our very own Silver Star winning son of a bitch. Phelps, he didn't die, Jack. He did just fine, and that's all we're going to say about it, right? The one and only. Look at this picture. Golden boy getting his badge, wife and kids in tow, and looking awful humble in the process. Well, he's that phony bastard. I wonder if they've been holding my job for me after all this time. What job was that? Mechanic. Ain't you seen all the war bond movies, Sarge? All the best mechanics is women. You're gonna have to work as a gigolo from here on in. <laughs> I was a bus driver in Santa Cruz. No, no pictures in the papers or medals for me, though. I can't believe I just went through Petaloo and Okinawa just to go back to being a washing machine mechanic. How is it that jerks like Phelps get it all? It doesn't have to be that way, guys. What are you talking about? It's always going to be that way. Do you have any idea what you guys are sitting on? Yeah, a ship full of army surplus. You're sitting on surplus morphine. Two tons of it. Can you imagine what that's worth on the streets? Hundreds of thousands of dollars. You're shitting me. I'm not. You're talking about stealing it? Keep your voice down. Do you want to have us all thrown in the brig? God damn it, Sheldon. You want to go into the dope business? No. I want to be in the peace dividend business. What is that supposed to mean? It means I want the guys who fought for a better future to get some share of it. You interested, Jack? Come on, Top. We could all get out from under. Oh, it's the chance of our lives. It's everyone or no one, boys. I'm not having a bar of it, Courtney. You may be the bravest person I have ever met, but I swear to God, trouble follows you around like a pet fucking dog. I thought you wanted to try for medical school. So what do you want, Jack? What's the future got in store for you? You guys were all heroes in the war. Every single one of you. Even if your next door neighbor or your wife never know it and don't give a rat's ass. Fuck belts and medals and citations and parades. Fuck the public who are bored with returning GIs. I have nothing but respect for what you guys and the rest of the sixth have done. You go through with this, and you'll be nothing.